welcome back to another episode of Autism's Minecraft server with me, of course, Autism's dad. And today I need to show you a little bit more of my Zeppelin. I know, I know, I know. Um, I've been working really, really hard and I've tried to do the best I can. Um, yes, I'm fooling you because I think it's absolutely brilliant. I absolutely love it. So are you ready? Are you ready? We'll do this reveal thing where we turn around very slowly. Oh yes, and look, this is the, the new town center area, which is uh, what Blue 354 is doing. Um, I love the centerpieces. But anyway, I am um, trying to distract you away from the Zeppelin. <laughs> oh, I hope you like it. Oh, there it is. So, wow, there it is. In fact, actually, let me just let me just check my ah. So let's take out a 32 chunks. I see it a bit more clearly, please. AMS server. There you go. What do you think, guys? Ah, what do you think? Obviously, it's going to look better without the dirt. I presume you would agree, but. It is a Zeppelin. It is. I am I I am quite emotional right now. I cannot believe that I, I did that. I built it. I built that in Minecraft and I died about a hundred and fifteen times. Yeah, a hundred and fifteen times. I know, I know. I'm a disappointment. But anyway, at least I have got this to show you. Now, it still looks like a white rocket, I know. But I will put, I promise, I promise, I promise, I will put some more colour in there and uh, we'll be able to see um, a lot more of the detail once I've put more colour in. But um, I really like the shape, I really like the size. I am completely happy with it as it is right now. So um, what I'll do is I'll take you back over there and I will show you from a couple of different views, yeah, what the Zeppelin looks like. So, Geronimo, let's go. Which way should we go? Um, i tell you what, let's actually go across the pathway. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Took me ages, but um, you know what it's like, guys. In Minecraft, you know, you've just got to... Um, oh, hello, bunny. Sorry. Um, you've just got to just knuckle down and just do it, you know? And sometimes you're a bit worried. You think, oh, people might not like it. You know, it might not turn out very well. But, you know, keep looking at, at what you're doing. Keep taking a step back. Don't go too far with things and um, you know just just keep checking on what you're doing and if, if it doesn't feel right I can tell you now right this these these fins at the back do you think that's the first try I did no absolutely not that took me ages and the reason why it took me ages was because it just didn't look right first of all I, it looked like a couple of triangles on the back which was rubbish and then I thought well okay let's just you know add a little bit more you know detail to it to the rear fins I changed the angles of them you know so it wasn't too much like a triangle it, it sort of came out a little bit more and um, you know it really did start to come together and that's that's really the thing is don't be afraid to have some patience and just relax into it and keep your ideas in your head always and just try and try and try to to get it to um, so it looks the way that you want. There's a couple of things I must admit you know and I'm gonna tell you nobody's perfect AD is not perfect oh no I'm not but there's a couple of things that I'm not completely happy with regarding this build but it is a good build yeah, I, I am I am I am I am accepting this as a good build of mine and I will probably reference this and talk about it 
um, you know, every day for the rest of my life. And I will tell my grandchildren of this. But um, but like I said, it's not perfect. And there will be people out there that go, no, I've seen better Zeppelins. I have. I've seen some amazing Zeppelins out there. However, this is mine. And I am happy and proud of what I've done. The same with the guys. You know, uh, you look at Ender Ben Blue. You know, he comes on the server and he has grown so much with his experience of, of Minecraft. And he's making these awesome builds and the one one thing I like about this build over there if you can see it uh, in the distance is that this this build that the the roof is perfectly done you know and he's got a nice porch overhang as well I, I love it I, I think it's such good attention to you know calculating the numbers of blocks that's needed to make it completely um, that symmetrical around all four sides. I really, really like it. We'll ignore Chicken Island, um, but uh, and and Big H Zonda with his battleship. You know that the good bits of detail using trap doors and buttons and simple things like that just to make it look really cool and really detailed. Um, it, it's it's brilliant. I really like what we're doing. And of course, you know we've got Queen Alley. Um, and um, and she's just, you know, with her bridge and things, that was my first look at, at the way that she naturalized uh, a lot of her builds. But she really does use natural things like vines and, and, and uh, um, leaves and, you know, turns the leaves into bushes and stuff. And, you know, the pathways are, are you know, using different types of materials and things. It's really cool guys so you know like I said this is my Zeppelin it might not be perfect but I'm really proud of myself I'm really really proud of myself so did I bring any ladders with me no I didn't I've just brought my last bits of clay um, let me get some ladders and I'm going to take you right up to the top because there's a couple of little things that I want to uh, finish off and I need some ladders to get back up the pillars so I'll speak to you in a minute once I'm back up. Okay guys, I've got a few more things. I've also brought up some coloured clays that I thought maybe we could use, but we need to have a have a look um, first. What, what I'm after, ah there it is, I'm after my bow. And the reason why I'm after my bow is because, look! Mobs are spawning on my scaffolding. <laughs> I've been trying to clear the scaffolding as I go when I feel... Because I, I don't actually mind removing scaffolding because I, I, I like to see... Um, I like to see what I'm doing. Uh, like, or, you know, I, I, I'll, I'll scaffold up, do a little bit, take the scaffold down, then go off and have a look at what I've done and, um, and then come back to it. So I, I'm all for doing things like that. Um, now what I'll do so yeah I'll give you an example of what I said I didn't um, it took me ages to do let's try again so um, I'll give you an example of what we'll just ignore that okay people don't um, don't tell anyone okay <laughs> don't tell anyone <laughs> Um, yes, yeah, so I've never died on this project. I'm really happy about that. And um, so I'll take you over to the rear um, of the Zeppelin, the fins area, because like I said, it took me ages. And I, I'll tell you what I did first. I had um, a couple of problems with it because I I didn't have this kick in. I don't know whether you could see it there. Let's see if we can light it up with a fire arrow. No, it doesn't light up. Um, let's go around this way then. I'm now I've got shift held permanently now because I don't want to die. Yeah. So can you see where it comes along and then it comes in a little bit and it goes long and it comes in a little bit? First of all, I had it straight, completely straight. And I mean like that whole thing took me probably about five lives I lost doing that and it, I what, what I thought is I thought oh yeah I could I could join it up to um, to, to the uh, um, the the stone slabs there and it could look quite nice so I 
done all the blue wall, I did all the slabs, and I thought, yeah, cool, and I came out and I took down my um, scaffold in, and I went over on top of my um, on top of my uh, uh, tower base, and I looked at it, and the first thing I said, do you know what I said to myself? No, no, no AD, no, it's bad, it's wrong. So I had to come all the way back up, rebuild my scaffold in, take it all down, and then uh, and then do it again. And now I think it flows with it a little bit better. It looks much better. Um, and I'm just going to come out a little because I want to join up with that guy there. So let's do this. And um, and the same with the, the side panels as well. You see where the sides have kicked in and they've gone round like that? Yeah. So this is also what I've... Um, what I've uh, um, tried to do as well. Um, let me do one thing actually because I just thought of something I could do while I'm here and while I've got you on. So I'm going to build out uh, some, well I'm going to come over this way with this scaffolding. Why does everyone use dirt for scaffolding? If this was in the real world and we used dirt for scaffolding there would be so many people dead, wouldn't there? It would be quite scary. Why, why do we use dirt? I don't know. But anyway, um, so we're going to try and use, oh, you know what? I can't, can't see it now. Um, we're going we're gonna to try and use um, some of these slabs to actually create like an attached band that comes right round the sides and the top of the uh, of the zeppelin so it looks as though the habitat area is like holding on to the um, to the oh! <sighs> like holding on to the balloon oh, I so thought I was gonna die then so I might take it up from there mm, I've got two slabs do I do a double band I don't know do I what do you think? What do you think, guys? I'm thinking maybe yes. Let's have a look. Oh, look at my um, uh, my shadow or the shadow of the zeppelin on the um, the community house. Look, it looks as though there's been a fire, and it's all burnt. Where's the fire brigade? Someone put it out. No, it does, doesn't it? It looks like it's burnt. Anyway, moving on. Right then, okay, let's do this um, like this. No, um, where am I? That one, that one, that one. So what I want to do is take these slabs up. Another one, I need to come in. And what we'll do do is we will hopefully start to see whether it's a good thing or a bad thing. And if it's a bad thing, then you know what? I'll just have to take it down. But I ain't going to get blamed for anything. I'm going to blame you lot because you made me do this. There's no way it's, I'm giving you lot the blame because you were like, oh yeah, autism's dead. Just do a zeppelin. Zeppelins are easy to do. <laughs> It's like the hardest project I've ever done in my Minecraft life. This is so, so difficult. But anyway, who's complaining? I'm not. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. Okay, stop talking to yourself. Okay, right. So, up we go again. A little bit more. And so, like I said... This is what it's all about, guys. Just playing. Playing and building. So I'm going to bring that to there. Slabs. Wrong one. Slabs. Bum, bum, bum. And now we'll have a look. Do you think I can jump? No, I can't jump. <sighs> right then. So, welcome back, guys. Um, excellent editing by myself um, we are going to go back up because I finished that double band and we're going to decide 
on whether or not we're going to keep it. Okay, you ready? One, two, three. Um, can't really see it. Can't really see it. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Oh, yes, I like the double band. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah. See, that's the kind of thing I'm talking about, guys. So we can bring it up to the top. We can take it right the way around. Yeah, it's looking pretty cool, I think, guys. What I'll do, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll, walk, I'll go back over. I'll take out that bit of scaffolding so we can see it. I'll also put the other ones on this side, taking it up. And then we'll have a look and, um, and see where we are. Yeah? And see what we think. And we'll, we'll take it down. And then we'll see if we want to wrap it right the way around the top. All right, then, guys. I'll bring you back in a minute. I need more slabs. I need more slabs. Okay, guys. I've come back over to my favorite spot on top of the um, Spleef Temple to have a look at things. And as you can see, I've now done the slab wrap around sort of I don't know what you would call it struts or straps that go right the way around all the way around to the other side as well and yeah again I think it's a positive um, it's pretty cool I like the fact that it's a double one as well rather than the single one which goes through the middle and right to the front yeah the other thing is is that the front hmm I don't know what to do at the front, whether I do something special at the front to, um, you know, give it some, give it some sort of a view. Let me, um, let me end a pearl, I've only got one end of pearl, but let me end a pearl over there. And let's go to Jojo Crafts Leisure Center, because I want to have a look from there. Hmm, can I go up in... Let's see if I can get a better view from up here. Oh, I'm on a trampoline. Oh, yes. Um, yeah, what do you think? Should I do something? I don't know, actually. See, this is the thing, guys. We're, we're, we all struggle with decisions, and sometimes we have too many choices. And I don't like it. I just want a simple choice. Yes or no? But I don't know. I can't answer it. Okay. Um. Oh man, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Someone please help me. Help me. So let's have a look then. What are we doing? What are we doing? Yeah, I don't know what to do about the front, but I am liking the band around the... It looks like... This is what I like about slabs, um, the stone slabs. From a distance, it looks like steel, doesn't it? You do get that sense of texture around it with like a steel uh, ribbon or bar that goes and holds the balloon down to the to the underbelly, the, the, the um, uh, living quarters, let's say. And then obviously the struts right the way through, and the fins are really cool looking as well. I really like the shapes of of zeppelins. You know, I think they're great airships. They're monstrous things, aren't they? So that's where we are with the zeppelin. Um, what is Storm doing? Storm, what are you doing? Is that Storm? Oh, no. I wonder who this is. Oh, I don't know whose horse this is, but it's got a saddle. Alright, let's just use him for a little bit. Um, yeah, so I'm liking the, the beans. Oh, this is a good view, actually, because we can see right underneath, can't we? And then we can see it going up both sides. Yes, there we go. There we are. That's pretty cool. That's a nice view to see how it works. So, yes, like I said, um, I think we've got a winner with those. Um, that's pretty cool. Now it's all about colour. 
because I think that's enough detail around the ship. I don't really want to go too mad with detail because you know sometimes it can you know you can get a bit too carried away. It's nice to have the detail, but um, yeah, I think color will bring this one together. So what I'm gonna do is, and I keep saying this, don't I? It's like it's the usual YouTube Minecraft video thing. What I'm gonna do, guys, is I'm gonna go off and do loads of stuff, and then come back and go, "Wow, look what I've done." Um, but uh, I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do because I need I need to look at it without without the um, dirt. I don't know what it is, but it's putting me off. And I told you this before, didn't I? I said like I don't, I'm not one for for keeping dirt when I'm trying to look at the airship. Um, I, I really would like to see it for all its glory as it stands at the moment, and just to have a little little thought around where I should approach the color introduction of color. Well, wow, that's a big big thing, isn't it? I cannot believe. I even thought of doing that. Do you know how many times I've been to the Mesa? <laughs> Scarily amounts of times. I've bought more rabbit potions than I ever thought I would ever use. But anyway. So, okay. I, I just I just need to think about colour. In fact, let, let me think about what I'm going to do now. Because I might just leave it up to you guys, actually. I might leave this episode with you, with a question to you. You know, you tell me what I should do about the colour of the Zeppelin. You know, you, you tell me. I'm, I, I'm thinking reds, greens. Uh, maybe, I, I, I don't know. I said this to you when I was looking at building the Zeppelin. Um, maybe reds. But I do love magenta, as you know. And I wasn't able to use it on Big H's game over there. So maybe some magenta. And the other thing is, is that I could actually do add the color from the inside, if you know what I mean. Because I can get up into the inside the balloon and then I can start to um, dig out sort of areas and then walk through it and then build it back up. So I could probably do a lot of the color work from inside the balloon. But the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take down all of the scaffolding and just sort of try and just live with it for a little bit and um, and see what it looks like. Okay, I'll bring you back in a minute. So then, guys, I'm back at my favorite spot on the Spleef Temple, giving you the last look of this episode, certainly, of the zeppelin um, again I want to have your opinion on things um, before I start to inject any more color into it let's let's see what the community think and um, yeah I think we're gonna leave it up to you guys so I'm gonna I'm gonna live with it as I say for a couple of weeks um, once we've got a few suggestions on board then we'll probably have a talk about it in the community and, and see what uh, See, see what we come up with but um, once again guys I thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one take care guys bye